What's good, y'all? <clears throat> I feel like every time y'all see me, I got this same shirt on. <laughs> but welcome back to another vlog. I am a little congested, so sorry if I sound, sound kind of messed up. But as you can see by the title, I am heading to Charlotte. So I am getting ready to get on the road right now. Um, I am just going for a day day and a half I guess you could say just to kind of envision my new life a little bit since I should be moving in about two months I want to say two months something like that so I'm gonna just kind of go envision my new life a little bit and uh just check the city out so it should be cool should be a vibe I'm gonna take y'all along with me um, for those who don't know, my birthday was Tuesday, July 18th, so I'm officially 30 years old. The big 3 0, I'm getting up there. So it's also like a little getaway, I guess you could say, for the weekend for me. So it should be fun, though. Um, I got a nice little Airbnb that uh, is in the city. So, you know, I had to do a little something, something. Do a nice little room. So. It should be a vibe, but I'm running behind schedule, so I'm about to finish packing up, putting the stuff in the car, and then I'll tap in with y'all in a little bit. Oh, and if you made it this far in the video, because I'm going to start saying this every single vlog, comment something. Today is going to be happy birthday. Just say happy birthday, Alex, or yeah, just say happy birthday, Alex. I want to see if y'all actually do it too, so I'm going to be watching in the comments. What's good, y'all? So finally, finally made it to Charlotte pulled up to the Airbnb. It's a cool little, cool little spot. So this is what you see when you walk in. Cool little island, cool little workstation right here. Kitchen, it's all like, this is a solid place for probably one person. I don't really know if two people can be here like that. But TV, couch, you know, this is, this is straight like bed now this part is raw this is tough so the view is okay you know all right y'all so i pulled up to my crib i don't even know if i'm supposed to be in here right now but you know doing it anyways for y'all so i'm in the master bedroom for my crib right now um, so you can see there's a little dog park right over here, which is cool. Closet, I believe this is going to be the closet. This, I believe is the bathroom and the bathroom is going to be so nice. I don't want to go too deep in there, but like I have two sinks. Um, I have a super, super nice shower and shower head that's going to get put in. Um, bathroom should be nice. And then I got... Washer and dryer are gonna go right over here. And then bathroom, second guest bathroom, is gonna be right here. And my two bedrooms, first guest bedroom, second guest bedroom. So decent little space. And as you guys can see, that outside of my crib will look exactly how these cribs look. So it should look pretty nice. And I'm gonna show you all the second level um, in a minute. All right, y'all. So right now I'm coming back down to the second level, AKA like the main level. So this is going to be where my, um, like little living room area. I think if I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong, but I think this part is supposed to be like the living room area. The TV is going to get hung right here, I think. And then this is supposed to be the, um, little kitchen. And I think the living room is gonna be over here. I could be getting this mixed up a little bit, so I'm not completely sure, but I think that's how it's gonna look. I'm gonna have a little patio right here. And again, that's the dog park. And I'll take y'all down to the first floor real quick. And then this is the front area, I believe. This is the entrance way. So I'm on the first floor right now. I believe this is gonna be the recreational room. So there should be um, this is going to be like my little mini gaming room area, probably I'm thinking. Um, and this is going to be a little extra 
storage area over here for me to just put some extra stuff. And then we have the um, garage. Yeah, it's the garage. So I know it's not too much for me to show y'all right now, but we're making progress. Crib should be ready in about two months or less. So we're making progress, y'all. But it's good to see in person. Yeah, this is just another view of the houses. So it's going to look something like this when it's done. But obviously with the tape and everything, this is what it looks like so far. So <sighs> new life coming soon, y'all. Pretty soon. Y'all, this top golf looks extra, extra dope. I'm not even going to lie to y'all. It's like a beautiful, beautiful day too. Beautiful evening. It looks packed though, so we're gonna see if I could actually pull up in there. Charlotte has definitely been a cool, cool little vibe for me. Um, today, Saturday, it's about seven, about to be seven o'clock. I haven't vlogged at all today because I really ain't do too much today. Um, I went to the mall, didn't even get nothing. I was looking at clothes and I was just like, man, I ain't trying to spend, spend no money like that. That's me being cheap again. So I'm going to have to give somebody some money and just have y'all get some clothes for me because I'm not finna go shopping myself like it's just not gonna happen but um i did that i was gonna go to this brunch spot called an easy sunday dang what's it called i forget what it's called um i'll put the name down in here once i remember but that was a pretty chill spot but it was gonna be like an hour and a half wait so i was like nah i'm not finna finna do that so i just pushed the shake shack instead and then i went to the mall um just window shop, just kind of looked around, people watch, you know, usual stuff. And then um, just came back home and been watching TV. I've been watching Insidious, trying to get ready for the new uh, movie, because I'm probably gonna watch that today, if not tomorrow. Um, and so I finished Insidious 1 yesterday, I finished Insidious 2 today. So I'm at least caught up for the movie that's about to come out, or that's already out, because I know it's based off of the first two movies. Um, but I still want to watch three and four probably this weekend too. So I might do that, but I'm actually getting ready to go to something grill. Why am I forgetting all these names? I don't know why I've been blanking out just all weekend, but I'm about to go to a nice seafood spot. So I'm going to definitely show y'all, show y'all that because it's, it's a little bougie y'all. I ain't going to lie. So I'm expecting the food to be, uh, pretty decent, but I hope you guys have enjoyed today's, uh, video so far. Um, it's literally, literally 24 hours in Charlotte for me. So I haven't really done too much and I haven't really been pressed because it's like, I'm going to be living, living here really, really soon. So I kind of just been vibing, just relaxing, kind of just trying to visualize like the new life, um, that's coming just now that I'm actually here in person. And that's why I try to talk to y'all about like just manifestation and just writing things down and just, you know, creating a vision board because these things will come true over time. You have to start living as if you already have those things. Like you have to picture that reality even when you have nothing at all. Um, so that's what I like to do just when I come to places. You know, I did the same thing when I went to Dallas last year, if you guys saw the Dallas vlog. So that's one thing about me is I'm big just on visualizing things first before they even appear. So it's just been nice for me just to relax, you know, get away from home for a couple of days, really bring in my 30th birthday or at least my 30th birthday weekend um, in the right, just relaxing, calm way, not a whole bunch of people around me, like just allow me to just focus and, you know, look at my new home that I'm about to move into and look at the area around and try to visualize, you know, some of the things that I see myself doing and um, the connections I see myself making and, um, you know, some of the investments or business moves or even YouTube ideas that I want to do out here. So that was pretty much the um, whole point of this trip. It wasn't to turn up. It wasn't to just enjoy myself. It wasn't just that type of trip. So I've enjoyed myself. I'm going to tap in with y'all when I get to the restaurant and appreciate y'all for watching as usual.
All right, y'all, so I'm back in Atlanta right now. Still gotta update y'all on the trip, but about to go see Insidious right now. Been, been binge watching the uh, movies all weekend, so time to check it out. And then I wanna show y'all the area around me when I'm done, so should be cool. <laughs> That's gonna do it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed that weekend trip with me. Um, it's been a couple days, today is Wednesday, so I've been back home for a couple days, but um, I had a great birthday weekend. Um, just a great time for me to just kind of clear my head and you know, just kind of get ready for my new life as I mentioned earlier. And um, the month of July is closing and this was just such a good month for me. You guys kind of know just kind of some of the battles that I've had to go through or um, I don't even wanna say battles, but just the test tests really that life has thrown my way just over the past eight, nine, ten months or whatever. Um, and it's just really awesome just to see things kind of start um, turning around for me a little bit and, you know, just getting ready to enter that new chapter of my life as I've touched on um, a little bit in this vlog. So to wrap things up, uh, the movie was good. Yeah, I give it probably like a 7 out of 10. I feel like Insidious Low-Key kind of gets worse with every movie they drop. I'm not going to lie. Um, but, you know, it was my birthday weekend. I just wanted to kind of get out the house for a minute and, um, you know, just enjoy myself outside. So I didn't get a chance to show you the area I really wanted to show you guys because, you know, it is just in Midtown Atlanta. It's just a really nice area just to go chill and just vibe out. So um, after the movie, I literally just went back home. <laughs> honestly and just relax so um but i appreciate everybody who stuck through if you did uh make it to the end of this vlog thank you so much for watching i appreciate you as always um i'm hoping to maybe start exploring more parts just in atlanta um and being able to at least share you know maybe some museums that i go to with you guys or um maybe take you guys with me to six flags i don't know just random things that i might uh do on the weekends but this trip overall was good. I have a better um, idea of what I need to do just as far as making sure I'm ready for this move. Uh, one of the things I decided to do is just deactivate Instagram and just kind of start getting away from social media again just to kind of help, you know, just focus on myself more and go internally again just on making sure that I'm focused on the right things as well as kind of just creating a budget um, for how much money I want to save between now and the time it is for me to move. So how much money do I want to save? Um, how much debt do I want to continue to pay down? And maybe I'll make a part two to how I save $10,000 in five months. I think I might be dropping a part two to that really, really soon and showing you guys the progress on what I'm doing now to save as much money as possible in the shortest amount of time possible. So that hopefully should be dropping pretty, pretty soon. Um, but if you did make it to the end, again, I appreciate you guys for watching. As always, it's Alex. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.